Well, good afternoon and welcome to my little abode. We're going to make now something that's called a tuna pate or not tuna pate. It's taken again from a raw food recipe and this one has got a cup here of soaked sunflower seeds, half a cup of celery or in this case it's two stalks and half a red onion, tablespoon or so of lemon, water, salt and parsley and we're going to pop it into the blender and make a dip. Now the great thing about this dip is that you can use it with crackers or you could stuff various vegetables with it. And so the, hence the, the name of not tuna would give you the indication that it's going to be kind of like a mock fish. So you could change that uh, by putting in various other ingredients. And it's all with these sort of clean living foods. It's really just a matter of practicing with things and seeing where, where your tastes go. Now I'm going to use a blender today, but you could use a food processor or one of these little individual whizzes in a bigger bowl. So we'll see how we go with this. So we'll put the ingredients in. So highly nutritious, sunflower seeds uh, supply an array of vitamins and are really good for the digestion. Celery, again I've put a little bit of fennel in this one to change the flavour up a little bit. What's nice about this is if you've got any allergies or digestive issues, you don't have to worry because you're not having dairy, cheese, a little bit of water, and our lemon. I'm going to put the lid on and give it a little whiz. 